Taylor Swift's new album, New Era, has brought significant changes to the European leg of her ears tour, sending fans into a frenzy. Not only did she introduce new songs, but she also added fresh dresses, surprise performances, a new stage intro, dress changes, and much more. However, what truly captured everyone's attention was her floating performance. As she commences the second leg of her ears tour, let's delve deeper into all these updates. On May 9, Taylor Swift provided an update to her fans. After a two-month hiatus, Swift returned to the Paris stage. During her first performance of the European leg, fans noticed Swift's alterations to the concert, which included modifications to her extensive setlist and costume changes. Swift hinted at having plenty in store for her audience that evening while addressing the crowd. Every time Swift performs live, she plays her well-known opener, which lists all her albums and career phases. Swift added a reference to TTPD to the modified mix. With new songs added to the three-hour show, it was inevitable that some tracks would be retired. Swift shuffled the order of her setlist to keep Swifties guessing. She transitioned into Evermore in the first leg, following Fearless. Swift eventually combined Folklore and Evermore into a single era, moving Red into Evermore's original spot. Additionally, Swift took a moment to celebrate the occasion by refreshing her show with an entirely new wardrobe. She looked stunning in an enchanted gown, a fearless dress, and a new lover bodysuit. Swift also donned a new t-shirt that read, This is not Taylor's version, during the red set. She debuted a beautiful new yellow outfit for her folklore period. Her signature reputation bodysuit remained unchanged. Swift introduced a brand new blue and pink sequin ensemble Ford 1989. She also dazzled in a new glittery Midnight's bodysuit. Swift performed a few songs from the TTPD anthology and a white robe after her 1989 period. So high school, but daddy I love him, down bad Fortnite, the smallest man who ever lived, and I can do it with a broken heart were among the songs on the set. One of their surprise tracks, LL, was also played for the Paris audience. The singer, who was dating the famous player Travis Kelsey, truly shocked everyone after a two-month break. What are your thoughts on Taylor's new era? Let us know in the comments, and thank you for watching.